Uh, we are so excited because today we're joined by St. Patrick's Day royalty. That's right. Liz Saunders from the Connecticut Central Connecticut Celtic Cultural Committee is the Grand Marshal for the parade here in Hartford tomorrow. Liz, we're so happy to have you here. Thanks for being with us this morning. Thank you, Tim and Erica. I'm very pleased. Mm -hmm. And of course, right off the bat, congratulations to you. We yeah. know you are excited about the parade tomorrow, like so many of us. What does this mean for you? You must be just thrilled. I really am. I am so honored and humbled, you know, to be chosen as this year's Grand Marshal with the 50th anniversary. You know, it's a once in a lifetime event. It is. Uh, and we're hoping a lot of people will be able to make out. Don't know just what uh, level of rain we're going to see, but please tell people why they should come out and make sure they experience the parade in person. Well, I think, you know, our parade symbolizes so much more, and especially this year after the return from our last parade in 2019, after a worldwide global shut down due to a pandemic. It is just so fitting that it's the Irish that's going to lead the city into, in our community, into the endemic. As we celebrate all things Irish here in central Connecticut. Mm. That's cool. and, yes. You are the chair of the central Connecticut Celtic Cultural Committee, which we affectionately call the five C's here. Yeah. Tell us more about what you do as a group. You prepare for this all year long. Exactly. Our, our planning actually starts the day after mm -hmm. this parade is finished. The current year, we start the very next day securing, um, you know, the bands, the groups, everyone that will be part of our parade. We have um, several towns that participate. We have Cromwell, East Hartford, Hartford, Glastonbury, South Windsor, mm. Wethersfield, West Hartford, and Newington. Mm. And those towns, they start their fundraising season off. They hold various types of events. We are self-funded. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, it does cost a pretty penny and with the help of the city of Hartford and sponsors like Fox 61, Hartford Healthcare, Last Parking, we are able to oh, yeah. put this event on. That is mm -hmm. great. Listen, thank you so much for joining us today. Congratulations on your honor. We will see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Looking forward to it, Liz. Thanks so much. And once again, congratulations. Mm -hmm. And for folks at home, remember, you can catch the parade live on the CW20. Our coverage starts at 11 a.m. You can also watch the parade streaming live on Amazon Fire TV, Roku, Fox61.com, and of course, the Fox61 News app.